Saladin's eye was fixed on Jerusalem. He, the righteousness of the faith, desired nothing more than to bring the Aqsa sanctuary back into the fold of the faithful. At this time, the demon Renald broke yet another treaty, wickedly seizing a caravan of Muslim goods and traders. Saladin swore an oath to slay this monster by his own hand, calling to arms every man, sword, and bow under his banner, Saladin made ready to keep his vow. On the eve of battle, Saladin laid a trap for Renald and the Franks. He ordered the citadel of Tiberius besieged, not for conquest, but to lure. A countess dwelt within, and the Frankish lords were sure to charge to her rescue. It is said that in spite of our great numbers, Renald himself led the charge, saying, the fire is not daunted by the quantity of wood to burn. How he would be mocked by the echo of his own words. The Franks had marched a great distance through arid lands without rest or water. Now, they would choke and stumble through fields set aflame by Saladin's vanguard. Welcome back to Age Empires for the Souls Descent. We've got to stop the Franks again this time by setting the dry grass here ablaze and then stabbing everyone. Because smoke inhalation is bad for you. We even get comic book effects here. The dry grass burned only for a short time. Once the flames had died, they could not be rekindled. All right, all right. There's the next patch coming. Let's wait a moment here because this, the grass is not going to burn that long. So we need to make sure it's it's still combustible. When these guys here arrive, we've got yeah early knights and the horsemen here. A difference of three armor here, that's actually quite a bit. Yeah, these are quite a bit stronger. I didn't recall the difference being that high, but then again, there could have been a difference between the original campaign and the multiplayer and skirmish stats. Okay, okay. But alright, get crossbow men here as well, excellent. Come over here. The enemy's breath was blackened with soot, and his luster diminished with every ill fated step. There we go, excellent. That's what we need. Yep, smoking is bad for you. The breathless Franks fell, but more would soon replace them. Saladin planned to use the land itself to defeat the Frankish army. He would seek out the most advantageous battleground and corral the exhausted knights, so bringing them to their end. Sure, we can do that. We can also get ourselves a bunch of spear guys here. Then let's get yeah, some upgrades here for our other troops. Here we go. And we want... 
Go on, knights here. Well, gonna need some more gold for that. Uh, sure, that's that's fine. Let's see. So these guys are gonna come from here. So let's. I'm gonna select that guy. Let's get off our horseman over here. These guys here are already in position. Good, good, good. Can we get more guys over there as well? Don't need any blacksmith upgrade here right now. More foods incoming. Good, good, good. And here's the attack route of, of this troop here. Got actually quite a lot of guys on gold here, and we also have a nice amount of upgrades. There's more guys coming from here. Word came that the main body of the Frankish army had begun its approach. Saladin's lure was working. All right, all right. Do a couple more of you here as well. This is nothing that my guys here can't handle. It's also more cavalry coming up at, at one point, I guess. Yes. Here we go. Lumber is. Tiberius forked widely across the hills. Saladin's men had much ground to cover. We should probably actually set this on fire. That might be an idea. There we go. There we go. Inhale the flames. Just ride straight through these guys here. And you destroy everyone here. I don't think we have access to Imams. I'm not sure we need access to those right now, but anyway, we're gonna come down here. Because we will want to see who's coming after us there. You hear also. Hmm. Joining the battle, the infamous Knights Templar rode headlong into the valley. Okay. Give those guys a warm welcome then. Uh, we are still training guys here. Got a nice amount of gold here. So maybe also see that we get ourselves some more cavalry archers here. Here we go. Camels are in position. That's quite a lot of guys. So we're gonna need uh, spears here. Do, are we training more spears? Uh, no, it doesn't look like it. Uh, you here can build me another mill here. Uh, we will all get to you in a, in a moment. For the time being, you need to snap. Come over here. Please. Not sure how many of these guys are affected. That may have been a, a mistake here. Let's get you here on the fields as well. May as well get two more here and... Sure. Okay, that wasn't actually so bad. There's more guys here. Intercept them there. I guess we could intercept them here as well. Let me just do that. Let me just have to see what uh, what comes after us here in the future. More archers here, sure thing. More guys there too. So you here will retreat maybe to this position here. If these guys go through here. Okay, what's the deal here? All good, all good for the time being. Please finish here. And then someone get me all this stone here. Okay, okay. That's were emboldened by the zeal of their leader, the self you think? Grand Master. Fancy title. I don't think we need more production facilities because I have the feeling the, the limiting factor here is really the amount of, of pop we have here. Okay. 
Einfach durch Feuer. Here we go. Start coughing and sneezing. You please come through here. And you help me out there. More guys coming from here as well. Do me a favor and I think those guys may not actually be weakened yet. So you just take out the siege engines, please. Because those uh, once once you close up to them, they just they just fall like it's nothing. Okay, you should of course build me a Nope, that's a that's a mill in mining camp here, yes. Seems like a sensible suggestion. I guess I could just flank these guys here. They don't have any... Who's coming from here now? Uh, we'll see. They don't have any... Camels, maybe? Then again, this is already burned down, so maybe you want to retreat to this position here. Yeah. Let's do that. Hey, just follow these folks here. You help me out here as well. More guys coming from here, but we do have some reinforcements on the way already. Into the fray, the Knights of the Order of St. John, known to their brethren as the Hospitallers. There we go. Bye, punks. You come down here. Question is, can I uh, stop these guys with just this contingent of uh, forces here? That's the real question. Not so sure about that. Have to see. Because we closed our pop cap, which of course only means so much. You here. Mm hmm. Let me keep uh, maybe here. Sure. Why not? Don't have any idle workers. Have a lot of resources here. Population cap reached. That's fine. We're going to get a bunch more of you here. Question is, do we think we can have these guys here support those guys while we are? Waiting for this this troop here. Yes, do it. Yes, definitely have enough time for that. Get in here. Yeah, this this should actually work out just fine. There we go. Nice. What they're sending Among now. The, Franks, the hospitalers were healers of great renown. Their grand master would lend his skill to the repair and invigoration of his weary knights. Okay, some more guys coming from here. And more guys coming from there. The question is how long these need. Can you intercept them? Well, we'll have to see. It's gonna take a moment, but sure. It should be fine here. And yeah, we have reached our po population limit here anyway, so yeah, that's gonna be it. For new troops. I could split them up further, but I wanna keep these guys here uh, because they're far away from, from my base and they're also... Oh, this is a bit more less predictable, whereas the situation yeah, I can easily reinforce this position if, if need be. There's more guys coming here. I mean, this troop here is not bad, but I guess I should probably yeah, position these guys here on the mountain. Also means you here. Should leave in the near future, because these guys might kill you on the way, but oh well, well, we'll see about that. 
Uh, let's see. We don't want want these guys here to to get uh, get distracted and then not go through the dry grass. Not the tall grass. That's a, that's a Stephen King novel. Hey, don't don't go around here. We want you to to inhale it. Here we go. Oh, they've got siege weapons there. We'll, we'll get to those in a moment. In fact, you know what? Let's get to those right now because those seem to have a long breath. Ah, there we go. I see. As usual, these here they die extremely quickly once they once they start dying. Yeah, they don't last long at all. Even I think they last even shorter than the ones in Age of Empires Three. At least that's kind of my impression. Here we go. Okay. A bunch of guys here. Could actually just ambush those. Might be able to ambush those from behind. Can we go around here? Let's see. We also have yeah more reinforcements for our camel troop here. And there's guys coming from that direction as well. But we also have you here. They're not allowed to build here, I guess. We build that right here. Proud Ronald himself, a flush with bloodlust, charged now onto the field, the theater of his own undoing. Who don't like that? Well, you have to decide. Do you want to fight me or do you not want to fight me? Ooh, should have picked your battles more carefully. You here apparently exist. Yeah, sure. Whatever. Sure, let's add you to the party. Uh, I want to do this a little bit more careful, but sure. Let's also get ourselves some more archers here. Well. Or well, as soon as our population limit allows for that to happen. I think these guys here should be stoppable here. There we go. And you here, I think we might be able to just charge you directly. In the think you here should really... What are you even attacking here? Don't like that. Let's see. With more guys, more guys coming here. You should set this ablaze, please. Let's do it. Get in there. Do things, please. Uh, you here. We'll wait for those folks. You have to come through here. Manageable. We should have sent more, more guys through there, evidently. So you take out these folks here and you just go straight to their siege engines okay everybody here's dead excellent and next line of defense here and you but well, you can come after these folks here maybe that seems reasonable you're all dead excellent anybody left here uh, you can be added to the other troop I have here. And then, wait a second, you're still alive, sure. So sure, whatever, and you come through here. I think this should work out in any case. No siege allowed here. Let's see how long you last here. This seems to be working out, generally. Still quite a, quite a lot of guys coming after us here. There we go. Then go after these folks here too. Uh, you here retreat a bit. Let's get in here, sure. They're gonna need a while here to, to take that stuff out. Uh, more knights and camels here and whatnot. You maybe go after the spears. There we go. One more down. 
The spears here could be a bit of a problem, but let's see. Nope, yeah. Let's see, but we've got plenty of reinforcements here. You may go after the archers. And then you join me here, and you join me there. But we still need more guys, because... Lost had quite some casualties here. Yeah, you're in the castle, that's fine too. It seems like we've stopped everyone here except for this troop here, so I'm not even sure we're gonna need this. There we go. Gonna need this castle here, but it would be nice to have, wouldn't it? it sure would be. Anyway. Come over here, Let's destroy the spears. You here dash forward to the siege engines, and you here eliminate. Well, there's more of them here, sure. That is fine. We'll be in range here soon. Nice, nice. Oh, and one more, sure. That due to the trebuchet pile. Yeah, they, they crumble like it's nothing. Nice. In a cloud of arrows and smoke, the battle was won. The utter ruin of the knights was so complete that almost none survived. At last, Saladin fulfilled his long-held oath, striking down Ronald with one true stroke of his sword. They say that Saladin wept tears of joy, giving thanks for this most glorious of victories. And there we go. I would say that was actually easier than all the other scenarios. And I didn't even use all the grass, but if you have the opportunity, do use it. I just didn't want to use the, the grass further back because of the feeling that it was too close to the city. But yeah, overall, you're given a pretty good economy. I just built some more, or trained some more villagers for food. But other than that, and some for stone, but other than that, that was basically it. Actually, some for gold as well. Never mind. I trained a lot more, more guys. But you get so many production facilities and you don't need to buy any upgrades except for the military ones that you can just queue up a huge amount of horsemen, which I would do because they're the fast units you have, and then this shouldn't be an issue. Well, thanks for watching and take care.